Hello everyone, very good morning and warm welcome to my channel guys. In today's video, I'm going to discuss IELTS real exam writing task 2, which was conducted on 18th of June in the evening slot. So guys, before I explain you, I request all of you to subscribe our channel because your subscription motivates us to prepare better quality videos for you having better content. So guys, if you want to have any sort of uh, video, you can mention in the comment box. And thanks for those who uh, just uh, write and who comment us, who tell us about our videos. And uh, guys, let's start without wasting our time now. Some people think that the fittest and strongest individual and team can achieve success in sports, while others believe that success depends on mental attitude. Discuss both views and give your opinion. So guys, let's have introduction of the same. The popularity of sports is never ending as since ages, a lot of events are organized where gathering is beyond imagination. Now the fuel has been added in the fire with the easy access to technology as all the events are live, which capture the attention of spectators. The players have onus of the outcome of the sports events, which depends on the mental attitude as per some people. However, team spirit is must along with the fit players. So guys, here paraphrasing has been done in the introductory part along with the explanation of the main ideas only. So let's start with the main body. To start with the need of skilled players having team spirit, physically fit players can perform the best as they can run fast if required as per the demand of their role. If players are injured, then they cannot do justice to their duty, resulting in the failure of the team. Besides the sports such as cricket, football are not restricted to a single player, rather a group is required to practice and perform. The weakness of one player can be the strength of other one, which can be utilized while making strategy of victory. So this is main body, paragraph one. Now let's discuss the other side. However, goal-oriented people have more chances to succeed rather than those without vision. Usually, targets give purpose to work on and determination helps to keep trying does not matter how many times they fail. The mental fitness helps to stay focused and achieve the goal. We have example of Milka Singh who had perseverance to achieve the target and the results remained phenomenal. So let's come to the conclusion. In conclusion, success cannot be restricted to limited factors, whereas it is a combination of strong will and continuous efforts. Therefore, the results achieved make the winners, which is unique. So guys, this is all about the essay. Hope you liked it. Uh, so guys, don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thanks a lot for watching till end.